Good evening. I first spoke with State Senator Fadi Kudura in September about an upcoming gun control bill designed to counteract the state's preemption law. And now we have our first draft. Senator Kudura says he plans to file the bill in the next several weeks. If passed, the bill would allow cities, counties and towns in Indiana to come up with their own gun control measures with caveats. Any potential measure must have backing from a local law enforcement agency and must comply with the U.S. and state constitutions. So any argument that any of these ideas, such as safe storage or background checks, or permits that they take Second Amendment rights from folks is completely not founded based on factual or legal precedent. However, some gun rights advocates say certain provisions in that bill would most likely not hold constitutional muster. Those include allowing municipalities to create regulations that would prohibit the purchase of assault weapons and raising the minimum age to purchase a firearm to 21. One Second Amendment lawyer we spoke to said if passed, the bill would create a patchwork of inconsistent gun laws across the state. And that's really, in my mind, where regulation ought to be focused, is at the state and federal level, not uh, at lo at, with local governments uh, who are going to um, create these disparate and inconsistent laws and regulations. Now, this bill comes several months after Indiana's attorney general found an Indianapolis gun control ordinance unconstitutional. That ordinance is not enforceable under current law. Reporting in studio, Hannah Adamson, CBS4 News.